Tired of dealing with annoying flies, fruit flies, and gnats in your home? The Zevo Flying Insect Trap is your ultimate solution. Don't wait. Check out the link in the video description now to get your Zevo Flying Insect Trap on Amazon and enjoy a bug-free home today. When Judge Catherine Burton issued a warrant for Katie Price's arrest for failing to yet again turn up to her bankruptcy court hearing this week, there was nobody more disappointed than her loyal friends and family. There she was, once again, in the headlines for all the wrong reasons. She'd failed to answer the court's summons and face up to paying her debts, said to be a staggering £3.2 million, after being made bankrupt twice. Instead, she jetted off to Turkey for more cosmetic surgery this time a £10,000 facelift, with her reality TV star boyfriend, J.J. Slater, in tow, although she insisted the trip was for work. She now faces being arrested at the airport when she returns. She could also be jailed, something she famously narrowly escaped in 2021 when she was given a suspended term for drink driving while disqualified, insisting she would go to the Priory to get well. Her behavior was met with disbelief from friends who have repeatedly tried to get the 46-year-old to understand the importance of respecting the law, and piles more humiliation onto her teenage children, Junior and Princess. Now 19 and 17, both are trying to forge celebrity careers of their own, Junior as a singer and Princess as a model, and those close to the family are fearful Katie's misdemeanors will overshadow their hard work. Seeing their mother arrested at the airport, they say, could be the final straw. The one silver lining, say sources close to the siblings, is that they have had a secure upbringing with doting father Peter Andre. Katie, who, under the name Jordan, began her career as a page three girl in the mid-90s, and Peter, a singer-turned-TV personality, were married for four years after meeting on I'm a Celebrity, Get Me Out of Here. In 2004, Junior and Princess are now old enough to see right from wrong, says a close friend. They are well-adjusted. They have grown up in a household where there have been boundaries. So seeing their mum behaving like this is difficult for them, it's sad. Junior is in the studio getting ready to release music and Princess is getting offered work all over the place, but they are so anxious that all they will be asked about is Katie. She is out of control. The male can reveal that months go by without Junior and Princess seeing their mother. In fact, a meeting a little over a fortnight ago was believed to be the first since Mother's Day. Princess, in particular, is said to worry about her mum. Princess is Katie's mini-me, they have a different relationship but Junior is pretty much at his wit's end with it all. It's devastating, Katie is their mum and they will always love her, but enough is enough. Indeed, they would not be alone in losing patience with Katie's self-destructive behavior. Insolvency and Company's court judge Catherine Burton said the former glamour model had received very clear warnings that she had to attend the hearing on Tuesday. Ms. Price was due to face questions in the specialist bankruptcy court in London from barristers representing the trustee of her two bankruptcies. A judge at a previous hearing said she risked arrest if she did not attend further court dates. Issuing the arrest warrant, Burton said Price had offered only piecemeal cooperation and failed to provide the most basic information in relation to her bankruptcies. She added, they have not received any funds or explanation. She agreed to pay it and did not. It then emerged that she had flown out to Turkey. She insisted she was away working for a documentary on corrective surgeries. But the backlash to her absence sparked a statement where, once again, she lambasted her critics and failed to accept responsibility. On Tuesday night she took to Instagram to write, I have and I am continuing to cooperate with the relevant people on matters to the best of my ability. Despite consistent stories trying to humiliate me on my personal misfortunes, I am neither embarrassed or ashamed. I own my situation and am trying my best to work my way out of it and put matters right. She also hit out at the media for, causing humiliation to myself and family. Ironic words from someone who has made a career from self-publicity since she was a teen. It has been quite a fall from grace for Katie. She and Peter were once one of Britain's most popular couples and they featured on several ITV documentaries. At one point she was said to be worth in excess. 